this is the question from electrochemistry in which you can see uh, this question based on the electrode concentration cell. Uh, you can see in the anode uh, they have given some atmospheric pressure of hydrogen and it is a 1 bar and uh, uh, this uh, hydrogen gas is dipped into ammonium hydroxide solution and similarly in cathodic apartment you can see uh, the solution is acetic acid and uh, hydrogen gas is there as an electrode and some values of uh, pKV of uh, ammonium hydroxide and pKa of acetic acid is given and some values are given. And when you are adding volume of 0.1 molar ammonium hydroxide anode half cell is given at again 100 ml of this value and for 100 ml of uh, 0.1 molar acetic acid in cathodic half cell is also given. Now these are the four statements we have to find out which of the following statement is correct statements. So let us see how to solve these problems. So first we have to find what is the uh, EF of this concentration cell. So what is the formula? So, at anode, uh, what is the amount of H plus sign and what is the amount of uh, uh, H plus sign in the cathodic compartment? So, we know the reactions, reaction is like this. So, anode compartment, how reaction will take place? So, hydrogen will split into uh, 2 H plus and uh, 2 electrons. This is an anode. And similarly, if you see the cathode, in case of cathode, what will happen? So, 2 H plus because this is an acetic medium. So, acetic medium will give you H plus sign. So it will take two electrons. This is a reduction reaction. This is a reduction reaction, and it will convert into your uh, hydrogen gas. So if you add it on addition, what will happen? You will get H2. This is the anodic, and uh, here you will get two H plus from the cathode, and this electron is cancelled out, and you will get here uh, H2. And this is from the cathode, and the remaining is two H plus from uh, this is anode part. Okay and uh, we know very well so this is the reactant product so we will if you take the uh, this is an equilibrium condition so what is the q so q value for this uh, will be your uh, h plus of uh, this you can see this the uh, 2 is given so it will be power anodic and you can write here and total h plus is given here h plus okay and this again cathodic because the hydrogen gas value is 1 so this is our uh, q value now after Q value, we need to find out the concentration of uh, H plus ion in uh, this anodic and cathodic apartment. So what is the, for an anodic apartment, you can see there is a uh, hydroxide. So first we will find the concentration of OH minus. So concentration of OH minus will be nothing but it is the KB into C. And what is the K value? K value is actually given very clearly. That is the 10th power minus 5. So we can write here 10 to the power minus 5 and concentration is 0 0.1. So it will be 10 to the power minus 6. On solving, you will get 10 to the power minus 3. Similarly, uh, yes, if you stick this OH, so here H plus will be how much? H plus will be uh, 10 to the power minus 14 divided by 10 to the power minus 3. So it becomes 10 to the power 11. Similarly, in uh, cathodic uh, apart, so, uh, compartment, what is the H plus sign? So, H plus will be uh, square root over Ka into C. So, if you see carefully, Ka will be how much value? So, Ka is given here 5. So, we can write here minus 5 into and concentration is minus 1. So, it is giving 10 power minus 6. A square root will become 10 power minus 3. So, here we know that H plus is uh, minus 3 and H plus fit for uh, anode is uh, minus 11. So, we can say put substitute this value. And we know the for a concentration of cell, what is the formula? The formula of uh, cell, uh, M, for, uh, M for the cell is, uh, that is E naught of cell minus 0 0.06 divided by N and log of uh, Q. And Q is already given here. So Q, if you substitute this value, so N naught value is 10 power minus 11. Okay, this is 11 and divide by 10 to the power minus 3. So you will get the value 10 to the power uh, minus 8 so we can substitute and for concentration inner value is what 0 so we can write here 0 0.06 and what is n value n value is 2 electrons so we can substitute 2 and log q is uh, how much it is your 10 to the power minus 8 so this is a whole square okay this is our whole square so it will be square so we can here minus 8 whole square so this 2 to cancels so on cancelling you will get here so the value will be uh, minus 0 0.06 into uh, it will come 8 so 8 minus 8 log 10 
so it will be value will be almost uh, like this one 0 0.86 means 48 volts 0 0.48 volts this is our answer if you see uh, what is the option option is given option is given here 0 0.48 volt so a option is correct now second option the last thing if the given cell is 0.36 volt and when 50 ml of uh, point sodium hydroxide is added to cathodic department uh, cathode compartment then what is the emf of the cell so we have to find out this one so now if you see carefully so acetic acid is there in cathode we are discussing cathode acetic acid and cathode will react with the sodium hydroxide so on the reacting it becomes your CH3COO Na and next is our water and this is uh, water and it is given here 100 initial concentration is 100 multiplied by 0 0.1 this is your 50 into 0 0.1 if you see questions given now at equilibrium what will happen so this will give you 10 millimole this will be and this will be your 5 millimole definitely this will full convert in this is will be converted this becomes your 0 so 5 mole this becomes your uh, 5 this becomes 0 and becomes your 5 so it is a buffer your you can see it is your acidic buffer is there you can see it is your acidic buffer solution so acidic buffer solutions uh, what is the uh, ph of this uh, uh, cathode department so question it will be ph will be uh, pka plus log of uh, salt uh, by a uh, concentration of acid so pk value is again if you see the question pk value is given 5 and log of salt salt is log 5 divided by 5 so answer is h and uh, if you find the emf of the cell so emf of the cell will be how much uh, it will be uh, 0 0.06 right and uh, this will be your pha minus phc this is the formula and the pha already it is uh, we found out it is your how much 0 0.6 and the pha is already found this is the 11 so it becomes your 11 and this is your 5 already we discussed so if you solve it 5 11 minus 5 so you will get the value uh, 11 minus 5 means it is your uh, 7 5 6 is 6 so we can multiply uh, 0 0.06 into 6 so it becomes a 0 0.36 volt so you got 1.36 volt in cathodic department now similarly uh, next option was given let us see what is given questions so question was given uh, here you have the 0.36 when 50 ml of it's already this option also correct now second is that if of the given cell is 0 0.36 volt when 50 ml of SCL is added to an department. So let us see is it 0.36 volt or not. So let us see. So now the our next reaction is ammonium hydroxide. So we are discussing about the anode uh, compartment. So anode compartment what is the pH and uh, if you add that much uh, SCL so what is the EMF of the cell. So ammonium hydroxide and plus HCl this will react it will give you NH4 Cl plus water right and here we have again 100 ml okay and the 0 0.1 molar this will multiply it it becomes your 10 millimole and similarly HCl is 50 ml uh, into 0.1 molar T. so it becomes your 5 millimole 5 millimole so uh, at the equilibrium what is finally what will happen so finally this will be your 5 millimole and this zero this is salt 5 millimole so again you can apply the ph so ph will be so here it is uh, uh, pkb that is the 14 you can see here 14 i can say minus and already we have seen the pkb value is how much it is your 5 pkb value is your it is given here already it is given the first questions let us see so pkv value is given 5 so 14 uh, minus 5 okay and again for minus 5 so this is a minus log and can say our first formula is salt by base so salt is how much 5 and again base is how much 5 so this is cancelled out so we'll get here 9 so it is coming about uh, 
five by five and nine. So P H C will get nine. Now next is what is the EMF of the cell? So EMF of the cell will be how much? So it will be again point zero six multiplied by and uh, this is uh, P H A minus P H C. This is the formula. And on solving 0 0.06 multiplied by pH is how much 9 at anode and cathode we have solved this is your uh, cathode is 3 already we have discussed 3 see already we found uh, already we discussed here you can see here uh, it is 3 already for acetic acid was 3 this much value already we discussed 3 so on solving uh, 9 minus 3 so you will get here so 9 minus 3 is 6 so 0 0.06 into 6 it is again 0 0.036 volt so this means that so if you see the question so it is saying that uh, the aim for the given cell is 0 0.36 volt when 50 uh, is uh, uh, ml of 0 0.1 molar as cell is added to the anode so this is uh, also correct see now they are asking if in anode compartment we are adding 0 0.1 molar sodium hydroxide Okay, here and uh, 100 ml uh, so cell will be 0 0.192 volts so let us check this one now in this case uh, what happens uh, fourth option so when NaOH is added NaOH is added uh, to anode to anode so in that case what happens uh, pH pH it pH was how much so in anode compartment pH was already it was 11 it was 11 so pH was already 11 so on addition of sodium hydroxide so it will be greater than 11 it will be greater than what 11 what pH will be greater than 11 so what will happen uh, and uh, a question given uh, EMF of the cell will definitely it should be greater than 0 0.48 volt because if pH is greater than 11 so it will be definitely greater than 0 0.48 and uh, given is 0 0.192 volt which is uh, it is a 0 0.192 volt is it is given okay but it should be greater than 0.48 but given this much in the question so it is impossible it is impossible the data is wrong the data is wrong so as per the questions uh, so yeah, yeah we have four options like the if the given uh, volt is uh, 0 0.192 volt I mean 100 ml of 0 0.1 molar sodium hydroxide added to anode compartment this option is wrong so only option A B and C this is correct options D is wrong thank you